Today has been a very long day for Kikuyu celebrities, especially wale wa kuchangisha na wale wanaimbanga. None of them have said justice for Jeff. MC Karago ameingiliwa, akaingiliwa, akaingiliwa na tukasema hizo michango zako utakuwa unachangiwa na maseleb because they are defending their fellow celebrity. They are fellow artist. Na saizi after kuingilia MC Karago, amekuja akatuwekea namba ya mama Jeff kwa page yake, atituchange pesa. MC Karago and others who drive on michango. Turamu ya atiriri, atutaki pay bill, tunataka haki. Na hau ni oturi, na tutilaki huwangua, na muwade mutikede. Fatso lazima ataholdiwa accountable kama anahusika na kifo ya Jeff. Mwede mutikede, hatutaki pebil, tunataka haki. Na hiku wakala hako, na atekenye, na ariagi, ala mutu raka musa hakitha kia koko. Ni muigwe na muigwe wega. Kuna huyu ya unauliza, swali la maana zaidi, ya meuliza, mbona hawa wa madem, wa mestuka, ama jamali kwa we malizo. If you analyze these ladies, ukiwangalia vizuri, unaona they look scared. Alafu ile TV wanaangalia hakuna kipigo kwa TV ni wallpapers zina zina change change the ladies look so worried wamestuka yao yote whatever they saw they are so scared they are wondering what next hmm? alafu let me ask you uko umeenda kumita celebrity somebody who is very famous will you be sad utaka umestuka hivi hmm? utaka umestuka hivi guys Guys, right now, these ladies wanafaa kuwa wameshikwa. Wanafaa kuwa wanafinywa. Wanafinywa na playa so waseme, waseme ni nini iliendelea? Ni nini iliendelea? Hakuna haja wakuwe tu wako huko nyumbani. Tunaona tu TikTok waki dance waki dance. Sasa hii wanafaa kuwa ndani. Basi sasa hii wanafaa kuwa wamesema ni nini iliendelea? Wao waliona nini? Wao walihusika kivipi? Kila mtu anafaa achukuliwa aperekwe mahali ya unge. And those stories should match. Ile story huyu anapeana lazima imatch na ya huyu mwingine. But they are giving it at different locations. Mmoja achukuliwa pereko Rimuru, afinyuo huko. Mwingine achukuliwa pereko Kandonzweni, police station afinyuo hapo. Mwingine achukuliwe kwanza huyu anapiga simu alikuwa anapigia nani? Because anapatiana House number anapatia na CG 617 or something anafaa chukuliwe. Eh? Apeleko huko mtitu wa ndei. Afinywe aseme ukweli. Eh? So mimi nimekasirika. Niko na swali watu wangu. Are you like trying to tell me simply because Jeff alikufa hivyo? Mnataka kutuambia Jeff atakuwa amekufa bila sababu Do you want to tell us that simply because mama ya Jeff hana pesa simply because baba ya Jeff hajulikani Jeff atakufa hivyo na apotelee hivyo Is that what you guys want to tell us Si basi mtuambie tuhamie Kenya nyingine tutoke hii yetu kwa sababu hii yetu hainanga justice When will a poor person get justice in this country of ours When will a poor person be served equally with a rich person is kenya only for the rich that is the question we should be asking ourselves is kenya only for a few people how comes do you tell me that until now nobody has been arrested how on earth do you tell me that a crime scene is still operating how on earth do you tell me that the same house the same place is still being occupied by tenants. How on earth do you tell me that still the Kasarani DCI hasn't done any arrest so far? Yet, it is 16 days down the line. 16 days down the line and no single arrest that has been made. Which Kenya are we, are we living in? I don't want to point fingers to someone, but the question is, are the people who were there, no anybody has been arrested so far. Until when will justice be served in our country? We voted for a new government. We voted for a new government, a new regime.
that said it will serve us all equally without any discrimination without any discrimination what are we experiencing today what are we experiencing now this guy is under six feet right now a guy who was full of fun a guy who was full of future but now his dreams are perished his dreams are done until when are we as a country going to experience this kind of a thing i can only imagine the pain that the parents are in the pain that the parents are in we as the online family we are ready to hire the very well renowned lawyer just to file the case again justice for jeff justice for jeff so this Jeff story is trending all over, is trending all over. Hmm? Na mimi mwalimu kuna maswali ambazo mimi naezataka kumnijibu hapa. The first question, kuna hii picha zina circulate, zinaoneshana Jeff akiwa mahali, amepigwa vibaya sana, tayari amekufa. Hmm? This was before he fell into the ground na kupasuka skull. So are those pictures authentic? That's the first question. Number 2 kama Jeff alianguka kutoka juu ya gorofa akaanguka hadi chini na neighbors walipotoka nje waliona waliona dirisha zote zimefungwa nani alifunga ile dirisha ya kina DJ Faso nani alifunga hiyo dirisha that's, that's another thing number two. number three, security ilipoenda ku knock all the doors neighbors watoke because kuna kitu imefanyika nje mbona hii room ya kina DJ Faso hawakufungua mlango ya yeah? That's number three. Na DJ Faso alipokuja mbona alikana alikana hajui huyu kijana. Mbona alikana hajui huyu kijana? Hajawahi muona. Eh? So, polisi walipokuja wao walichukua walichukua mwili wa kupeleka city mortuary. So, as an unknown person, hajulikani huyu ni nani. Eh? Huyu hajulikani ni nani. So alichukuliwa tu ni kama chukura tu ya, ya barabarani ama tu somebody they don't know. Yeah. Number another another point of concern is the pathologist. There was no post mortem that was done. Yeah. So kijana past 72 hours. Kijana alipotelea hivyo. Then after the burial ndio sasa mambo imeanza kujitokeza why was the family quiet why was the family quiet of the issue so family ilienda pale ikaambiwa kijana wenu aliruka akakufa wakakubali why were they quiet how come sign ndio wameanza kuongea so many questions are arise eh? but we hope the dci will do the work we hope the culprits behind this will be arrested uh, and we hope in future no such things will happen guys let us pray for the family as they are grieving let us pray for the friends of this boy jeff and we are mourning also as the people of the mount kenya region pia tuna mourn because imefanyika in our backyard